everybody and welcome to EXP's final world where the sheep keep disappearing and the end is only the beginning! Hooray! So, today is a special day, as all days are. Um... Uh, as is kind of the story with this entire Let's Play so far, I recorded yesterday and didn't like it, so I deleted it. But that's not gonna happen today! We are gonna have a fun day and get stuff done, and... I have worked a little bit on the, um... Yeah, I guess the secret is out of the bag, because I'm an idiot. Uh, but this is a... What this is going to be is a condominium for the villagers. And I've just added a bit. I've added some... Whoa! Ouch. I have added some uh, wooden supports. And I think I'm at going to have a floor under there. I don't know what's actually going to be there. I haven't really thought this through much. But... Yeah, and again, this is just the underside. Uh, the actual village is going to involve a lot of wood, and this all this is is just basically the earth below it. I think I'm going to try and get grass up there and stuff, maybe get an above-ground pool, and then we're going to build a condominium that is not going to be a skyscraper like I originally planned due to a uh, exploit involving many, many, many villagers. And we're going to avoid that. But... So, yes. Uh, today is day 43 in the world. Uh, been doing some stuff. I don't know why I went over there. Because there's one sign in particular there that I didn't want to look at, and I had to keep it off camera. It's a secret. But you're gonna find out what it is in this episode very shortly, because we are going east! To where, you ask? Actually, we are not going east yet. Not yet. I have to very quickly, very, 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 very quickly, if I could run faster. I should really make a whole bunch of speed potions just for these Let's Plays, because this video is going to... I'm always concerned about the video lengths, but let me just quickly melt these. Oh, I so wish I could melt this. Maybe I can. I don't think I can. I'm still gonna keep that. My precious... My precious Fortune 3. I can't give it up. No, I can't melt that. Well, guess we're gonna just break it. Alrighty! So, allow me to rebuild those, and I will... Oh no, I don't need to cut the video here. It's a short enough walk. What do we got in here? Nothing of interest. Oh, actually that chest is full. I don't need to pick those up anymore. That chest was not full a couple of days ago after I decided to refill my wolf dispensers. Uh, you can... You just have one double chest of rotten flesh and, like, 12 wolves like I have. Um, not enough. But, yes, we are not refilling the dispensers today. We are making tools quickly don't cut all day yes yes very good 
Oh, hey, these face different directions. Oh, that... Yeah, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Because you dig down like that. Except, if you're bringing the shovel that way, I would think that you kind of get the dirt on your feet. Well. I guess that's Steve's problem. With these, and with these donuts, I imagine weight will soon be a problem. But we're not going to worry about that. Because the last thing... Well, no, I look pretty fit. Bet you can still see my muscles. A cookie if you could guess what the skin is. Only one cookie. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure anybody who watches cartoons or reads manga knows already what it is after the single look. <clears throat> I should really make my own skin soon. But, yes, we are going east right now. Actually, this is not east. This direction is not east. Wait for it, wait for it. Okay, we are now going east. Wait a second. No! No, that was east. Okay. I just figured it out. <laughs> this is south. And we were going east. And we're about to go east again. Hooray! No, wait. I think I turned left at some point on this. Uh, okay, it doesn't matter. Does. Not. Matter. Overall, the it's speaking in terms of average directionality, we are going. Oh, die, will you? Oh no! I, I where are my arrows? Where are my arrows? Oh god! No! Not cool. Oh god. Okay, that's um. I should probably not be doing that. I should probably be fighting on more stable ground. Oh, Jesus, these ghasts. It's unbelievable. Okay, so. This is one of my strongholds. Or, wait, what am I saying? It's one of my strongholds. What am I saying? This is another fortress. And this is not one of my nether fortresses, this is the only one I found. Right, but, as you can see, we are going in the plus X direction. Which, if I had a map... Which I don't. But, if I had a map, it would be quite easy to verify that this direction is, in fact, east. Which is... Uh, kind of funny considering if I had a compass, I wouldn't be able to tell what direction it was. Uh, I don't get how the map became the tool for determining north in Minecraft. In, in fact, the compass does a better job, frankly, of telling you where you are than the map does, because... The map is so zoomed out, you can't really tell what anything is. At least the compass tells you where you are relative to your spawn point. But here we are. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess there's going to be a slight bit of a delay before we actually go in the portal. I don't want you messing things up. You're just going to disable my portal and make life complicated. Thank you. I wonder if it's dropped a tear. I can't see! Too far. And I think Optifine makes the items not get drawn unless you're close enough. Or maybe that's vanilla, I don't know. Alright, so... The reason we went so far east is because... We are going to... Japan! Oh, we're facing the wrong way. Japan! Now, 
Uh, what this is, is, um, uh, how do you pronounce it? Do I pronounce it with, uh, Japanese pronunciation? Okay, I'm gonna say Eriyoto-san's Japanese Weapons and Architecture mod. Eriyoto-san, yes. Um... I don't know, I would just say Ariato, but... I don't know, it doesn't matter. Sleep eating. Um... So yes. Uh, these are... Some... Sakura... Or Cherry Blossom. Man, these are just the leaves. It, this is not... Uh, Okay, I know that uh, there's a Better Than Wolves add-on mod that adds cherry blossom trees, among other things. Uh, th this is not that. Uh, this is something else. Um, in fact, this is something very neat. And this I all built in one day yesterday. This is the home for what is called the Ancestral Infuser, which we are going to set up. If I can find where I put it. I got blown by a creeper at some point, and just... All my chests got blown up, and then I just started putting random stuff everywhere. Because I didn't feel like sorting all my items yet again. So now just everything is everywhere and I can't find it. Um... Okay, so we are going to be placing this today. And hopefully... I don't know, it's... There usually seems to not be a whole lot of time in the episode to get stuff done, so maybe I won't be able to do some of the other things that I wanted to do today, but we'll see. What am I looking for? Okay, um... I need time to think. Uh, be back in a second. Alright. So, I'm just gonna make this really simple. Because I don't want to take too much time on this. I've already built the majority of what I'm making. No, we don't have any more nether brick. Oh, this took so much nether brick to make. I took all the nether brick that was in my nether supplies chest back over at my base. So we're just gonna make this a simple platform. Uh, we want to be able to collect the things that fall from the ancestral infuser. Uh, we don't want them just falling down there. Ooh. Oh, but we also don't want to obscure my... ...design. Hmm. Well, whatever. Uh, how much of the design can we still see? Not much. And I want the Ancestral Infuser to be in the center. You see, I should have just made that lava. That was the original plan. Um, just the entire thing down there was going to be lava. And then I didn't do that because... I had to keep running so far to get lava. And I was like, screw this. I hate walking all the way to the other side of the nether to get lava. So, I stopped. Hang on. Okay, well this is... I guess this is just going to be temporary. Because mostly what I want to do is I want to show you how this mod works. And I am beginning to run out of time, so... I should get to that soon. Like right now. 
And I believe that I have not quite yet properly set this up. Uh, I'll explain where I got this stuff from later when I get the chance. Uh, you you kind of have to see it to, to know what I'm talking about. Yeah, okay, I need to break this. There we go. Yeah. So the Ancestral Infuser needs to be placed on top of Soul Sand. And it requires the nine blocks above it, this 3x3 three three square. The eight blocks around it. The eight blocks around the Soul Sand. And the nine blocks below them to all be empty. And also needs to be at a light level of seven or lower. So if I place a torch here, it would... Yeah, it turned white again. Uh, and these are all stairs so that enemies aren't spawning here. Um, I'm not quite sure I like how it looks. I was going to try and make this all like light level nine or eight or nine. So that this would just be like at maybe five or something, so that enemies would still not spawn here, and this would still be dark enough. But then I figured I want this entire room to be dark. Hey, that's not dark. There we go. I, I like it better when the room looks dark. So, partly for aesthetic reasons, uh, I've used stairs rather than light to keep enemies out. So, I just wasted about five minutes when I only had eight minutes left to start with. You know, I'm probably just going to change the 20 minute limit on these videos to half an hour or something. Because 20 minutes is not a lot of time to get stuff done. But... And see, I'm still talking. Look at that, I'm still talking. Let's do stuff. Doing stuff. We are infusing the soul sand with... Ancestral spirits. Or... Whatever they were. There were things. It is now infused with 34 units of Japanese culture. So, what do you do with culture, you ask? And excuse me if you could uh, hear that... Uh, gastrointestinal... Reflex... Not reflex... Thing... Sound... Noise... Words. Uh... Alright, I'm not really sure if this is going to work out, but we're going to try it. Uh, what I need is a platform... Oh, I can't... I can't pick up that... I can't pick up that fence! There we go. D nonsense. I'm good, now I can put this fence where it belongs. Uh... Stuff needs to be tossed on top of the Ancestral Infuser uh, to get some of the stuff in the mod. So... Oh, this looks terrible. Why am I using cherry planks for this? Okay, so... I'm just making a little platform up here. Oh god, this is so temporary, you won't... You, you don't even believe... You don't even... Think sentences through! Why am I not thinking sentences through? Okay, so... Yes, we need to throw stuff... ...onto there, like, for example. Okay, none of this stuff can be thrown, so these are all bad examples. But Criminy. I'm just gonna throw a... There's a regular sapping. I had regular saplings before. What'd I do with the regular saplings? How am I supposed to do a demonstration 
Okay, 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 we... It's not a problem. Uh, I already have plenty of bamboo, but we can make more. It's not gonna kill us. Just doing it for the demonstration. Alright, so... You toss stuff on top of it, and remember we have, uh... How many? We have 34 units of Japanese culture. So we're gonna toss this thing on top of there. Uh, like uh, so. Damn it! Okay. I may have... No, I did that right. I dug that hole right. It should hit the wall. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh no! And I apologize if this is a little too dark for you to see. Okay, so I'm just going to toss it. Good. Okay, so it hit. It f landed on the Ancestral Infuser. And we now have 33 units of Japanese culture. And we have... Bamboo! So. Just gonna get rid of this. Because I have plenty, as you can see. And I would discuss the various plants and stuff in the mod, but I there is something that I really want to do. And we don't have a whole lot of time to do it. Of course, I could just let this video extend past its time. That would take a lot of the pressure off of me and make me overall a happier person. Oh god dang it! No iron! Nah! I need iron! We got iron! So, we are going to quickly craft these. Yes, yes, yes. No! Bad. Okay. And... I like these recipes, they're nice and easy to remember. So... Yeah, I don't even need to have the... thread open. Which is nice. I like... simple recipes. We have made a cherry wood drawing unit. And... A cherry wood soaking unit. Hooray! Now these, like the ancestral infuser, have special restrictions on where they can be placed for them to work. I apologize to all the obsessive compulsive viewers who just had to watch me eat donuts when my hunger bar was already full. Yes, I like getting my food saturation bar, which is one of those uh, aspects of... and one of those complicated technical aspects of Minecraft that I'm not going to explain, but I like getting that filled up a little bit before going out so that I'm not constantly eating. Okay, so... I was looking for wood. Wood, yes. Let's get wood. And make boats. Okay. And now... I'm not sure if you have notice this yet, but we are in a swamp. And... Um... This is not something that you would have seen in my world up until this point. Because up until this point, I have been using the Generator Ports mod to have 1.7.3 terrain. And even though there's an option to enable jungles, 
uh, with that mod, you can't have swamps. So I actually specifically disabled the mod just for this part over here. Uh, which is not much of a problem because look at our coordinates. Uh, I, I don't think we have to worry about suddenly crossing the border between the 1.7.3 terrain and this. But, ah! Ooh, made it. And I remembered to turn off F3 this time. Hooray! Okay, so we are looking for... This, okay, this is going to sound just a little strange, but we are looking for a dead shrub. There you are. Oh, you can't silk touch those! You'll probably pick it up with a block dispenser, but... Hmm. Alright. Fair enough. I am going to get some sand. The way that you place a... Um... A cherry wood drying unit, if I remember correctly, is sandstone, with eight sand around it. I'm assuming that this is all sand around here, usually the sand is at least two blocks thick. And... Another layer of sand, the top layers you can see right here. This on top of the sandstone, and a dead shrub on one of these eight blocks of sand. So, if that is all correct, I assume that means it is. Hooray! So... I didn't bring rice stalks! What am I doing? Okay, so... I wonder if you can dry cactus. Hey, that's a little off... Ooh, that's a little off-center. Oh, that's because this is... Could it be the texture pack? I don't know. Um... It would suck if I broke that thing. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so worried that I'm gonna break that. Okay, so I'm gonna bring some more stuff to dry. Because I apparently brought nothing to dry.